As expected, Apple has released the 8th beta of iOS 26, and this will be the last beta before Apple releases the RC version and then the public release of iOS 26. So in this video, we're going to take a look at this update and I will show you guys everything that's new with the 8th beta of iOS 26. Now, before we get into all that, I just want to ask you guys for a really quick favor. Most of you guys that watch my videos are currently not subscribed to the channel. So if you enjoy the videos and you find them helpful, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. It really helps a lot. Now, let's get started, first of all, with the size of the update. Now, even though this is the last beta of iOS 26, 26 it is still really big in size of course you cannot expect a lot of new features with a beta 8 but the size is quite big at 9.6 gigabytes here on the iphone 15 pro max so it should be around 9 gigabytes of course it's always different on different devices now this is the build number for the last beta of ios 26 this is 23A5330A. A. This is the build number for, again, beta 8, which will be the last beta of iOS 26. So what's new with this update? Well, as I said, it's a beta 8, and you cannot expect a lot of new features and changes. For From what I have noticed right here, the main changes here will be on the liquid glass design. It actually has been adjusted in a lot of places, First of all, it looks like the control center, it's a bit more transparent as you can see right here, which is really nice alongside with the background of the dock as well. It looks very, very good in this case right here compared to beta seven, which was a bit darker. Now you will also notice very, very smooth animations here when going to your lock screen and going to your notification set a really nice animation and also of course to the spotlight search and what's really cool is that the adjust the basically the keyboard the background of the keyboard has been adjusted as well so it's now a bit lighter right here on the background of the keyboard even though we still do not have the iOS 26 keyboard on third party apps, just on Apple apps. But again, overall, the adjustments have happened just on the liquid glass effect, as you can see right here in a few different places, like the photos, for example, you can see that liquid glass effect right here, which is really, really awesome. And it looks like they have actually added and improved this effect on a lot of places now that we're on the eighth beta. And of course, this being the last beta, this is basically what we're getting released to the public so these are pretty much all the changes that you will find on this update we have not been able to actually find anything else new despite these smaller like adjustments to the liquid glass design the dock here the background of the keyboard and the control center now as i said this will most likely or it will be the last beta of ios 26 expect the 8th to be the day that apple the 8th or the 9th of september to be the 8th the day that apple will release the rc version of ios 26 and then of course the 15th should be the day that we get ios 26 Six released to the public so that is it for this video guys thank you for watching leave a like if you enjoyed the video and i'll see you on the next one